That's, that's, oh, oh my God. <laughs> we found snow. All right, attempt number 24. Chicken and eggs are not allowed in the US. This was a total fail, absolute fail. Okay, let's head down there. I wouldn't say success yet. We still need to make it to the top. Did you see all the signs, no weed? <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're gonna check. That yep. we almost couldn't find and Bob almost lost his mind. I legitimately almost lost my mind. <laughs> that was annoying. We've decided to take a little detour on our East Coast uh, trip and head to Canada. But this wouldn't be a Van Caskey slash Mr. Lemon video if we didn't have a major issue going into Canada. So our issue is we have a water leak. I thought I had fixed it in, a, in our previous episode where I basically took the bathroom apart. I tightened up some of the fittings and thought life is good. We dried everything out and it was, seemed fine. And then this morning, the floor was wet again. So something else is going on. I don't know exactly what, but I'm a little frustrated and disappointed. And it's all happening right as we are getting ready to cross the Canadian border. So we could be without water for the rest of our time in Canada, but first, we're gonna head into Canada, and our first stop is gonna actually be dumping our cassette toilet. It's been way too long since we dumped it, and we are in great need of it. Thankfully, iOverlander had some options, so as soon as we get into Canada, we are going to stop and dump our cassette toilet. Morning. Where are you from? Um, Arizona. Oh my, okay. <laughs> We're from home. Yes, we it's are. It's cold over here, right? <laughs> it uh -huh. is very cold. Uh -huh. Winter's coming. <laughs> it is, certainly We're, is. We're chasing fall. <laughs> chasing fall? Yeah. We're chasing winter. We uh, maybe have some place with snow over here. Uh, yeah, yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah. Already? Yeah, already, yeah. Yeah. In wow. one bend or some places, some ski station, there's some snow on the top, right? No here. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it was minus. Minus one this morning, minus two. Stop. So, yeah, for you, I don't know, it's below 32, so mm -hmm. I don't know. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So, yeah oh so my. We got snow already. So where are you eating today? Um, what's How do you say it? Magog? How do you say that? Magog. 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 Yeah, that's yep. all right. Magog. That's yep. all right. For, okay. For how long are you going to be there? Just today. Just, just the day. Just the day? Mm -hmm. Okay. And after that, you're waiting where? Uh, back... Newport, Vermont. Okay. Yep. Okay. Okay. So just a, just a day. Yep. Uh, yep. So you're going to go to the May Magog and the lake and uh, have a yep. have a lunch over there? Yes. That's yep. good. So any, anything special in the vehicle with you? Any kind of weapon in the vehicle? No weapon. No, no weapon, no handgun, paper spray, mace, anything like that? Nothing. Nothing like that. That's perfect. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Yeah. We want to keep it that way. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yep. Yep. Yeah, that's all right. Because you're very far from here, so you don't know all the rules over here, but uh, no defensive weapon or anything kind like that in mm -mm. Canada. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's all right. Any nope. kind of food in the vehicle? We do have food we in the fridge. Food. Okay, uh, any vegetable, fruit, or anything like that? No or fruit. No. 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 Okay. no vegetable either, right? No. No. Okay. no. no. That's all right. Just, just meat? <laughs> yeah. Meat. Just eggs. Eggs, that's, all, that's, and, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, your eggs from the States, that's, that's, that's all right. Could it, should be all right, but declare it on your way back, okay? Okay. Because right now, uh, chicken and eggs are not allowed in the US. So. Oh. Okay. 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 So just make Maybe sure. Maybe uh, yeah, Just explain that if there are they are U.S. But I don't know. Maybe okay. They're gonna keep it. Or, yeah. Uh, well, whatever. Okay. That's I okay. Wanted, I want just want to tell you that. Okay. So okay. I'm gonna go to take the plate. Okay. Oh my gosh, he's so sweet. Yes. <laughs> very very fun. Yeah. And I, yeah, they, I forget that they do speak French. 
There you go. Okay. Awesome. Enjoy your stay. Thank, right. you Thank, you Thank you very much. Yes. Awesome. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Literally the best. That was border crossing ever. Yes, we need more border crossings like that. And the nice thing was, is there was no line or anything. No. Like, well, I mean, five minutes. 55 miles an hour does not equal 90. Oh, I got to look at my other side of the. Oh, yeah. The gauge. Yeah, it's already in kilometers. You're speeding. Oh, no. No, it was trend. Oh, it's right there. Radar detectors prohibited. Okay. So now we're headed to a dump station. Yes, that's where this is taking us. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Prettiest place you ever dumped our toilet? Pretty much. That's crazy that it's just free to dump. Okay, and you're certain that the lid's closed all the way? Yes. Because <laughs> the last time it wasn't. That's, that's bull. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's been quite a while since oh. I dumped it. Wow. Okay, don't dump it on yourself. I'm pretty sure I won't. You don't need gloves, huh? It's too late for that now. Here we go. So what I do, is I add a little more water. <laughs> what are you doing? You're literally getting our van all wet. <laughs> I'm trying to get the water in there to rinse it out. It's terrible. That was not good. <laughs> This is just real life and life. All right. Job one is done. Job two. Are you disgusted by your own hands? I kind of am. <laughs> I can tell. Should have worn gloves. But I mean, look at this beautiful place. I'm assuming that that's what that's for. I don't know, but that's what we're going to use it for today. like where do you look it's all beautiful like i just keep finding myself going like oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> well and the thing that i'm surprised by google maps is kind of wrong it does not have stop signs in the correct places it's trying its best and it's in canada and it's french sounds weird but let's be honest it's gonna be better than ours oh well, that's true interesting they're like washing the streets i just think that this is amazing oh i was wondering why the streets were wet they're washing them that's what he's doing oh so can i park here oh well okay stop two in canada we saw a random bridge that just said, hey guys, come walk on me. So we said, okay. Pretty much. So I, I believe it's a seven minute walk from this parking lot and I don't dare try to say the French names. We walk up this hill and then we can cross that bridge that we saw on the way over right up there. And hopefully we're good to go as far as parking here. I, I think so. Let's cross the road and we'll walk up that little path to this crossover. Well, I'm a little concerned. There is a path right on the other side of this fence. Let me switch hands. Right here on the other side of this fence, there's a path. I'm a little nervous that we were supposed to go in down there by the parking area and then we can cross over the bridge. So we may have hiked to the top of this hill for no reason. Stay tuned. Okay, I was right. 
Looks like we had to go in at the bottom of the hill where we parked, and then we have to walk back up the hill inside the park. We can't just cross over from the street. So take two. Take two. Well, it's not take two yet. Right. We got to get to the bottom and hopefully it's open and we can get in. Oh my word, what so, are we doing? Anyway, so if we can't get in and we miss the photo opportunity, what do we do then? <laughs> what? What if it's closed? Well, then we just keep going. We jump in the van and keep going. Okay. So we don't have to walk back up to the top to then get the picture? No. Okay. If we didn't get to go on it, we don't deserve the picture. Fair enough. Total fail. There's a gate, it's closed. Everything seems to be shut up, maybe for the season, I don't know. But it's kind of disappointing. We just can't go walk up a hill and across the bridge. So this is what we would have gotten to do. I just can't see the hours of when it's open. What do you do? Total fail, but that's okay. On to the next thing. How can we complain? We're in Canada. Plan B or C. I'm not for sure which letter we're at on anymore. We're going to go to Tim Hortons, which we've never been to before an actual real Tim Hortons and get some coffee. And apparently this place opens in 20 minutes at 10 AM. So we're going to come right back here and try to cross the bridge. Fingers crossed. Get us some coffee and donuts. It's the little things that matter. It's the Canadian leaf on there. Oh my gosh, the Canadian leaf. Oh. All right. I don't know what you called this, but that it was their most popular. What does it taste like? Like a glazed donut? Like a glazed donut, but it's got a, like a slightly different texture, which is really good. Crispy outside and then like kind of chewy inside. It's pretty good. And I went with the tried and true. I'm a sprinkle girl all the way. Look at how perfect those sprinkles are on there. I mean, come on. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This is probably the best donut I've ever had. That's amazing. So that awesome guy at the border told us it had already snowed here. Clearly. He wasn't joking. Snow. Okay. It still doesn't look open. Okay, last attempt. Walk down there and see if it's open. All right, total fail. It's closed. Even though, if you look it up online, it says it's open. It even says, like, these dates. It should be open, unless we're just not at the right entrance. Maybe there's another entrance. No, I think that's the right entrance. It says Welcome Center. So I don't know what else to do. I can hear the Sad. river. Yeah, we wanted to walk over that bridge so bad, even though it looks scary. So, OK, well, I guess temp number three fails. fail. But we got some good coffee and donuts out of it. 
there is a camping over there and you can start the hiking trail from there. And can we go across the bridge? Yes, <gasps> it's just one kilometer more from there. Okay. And there's a parking too if you want to bring the car down there. Sweet. Thank you so Thank much. You. Yeah, you too. How lucky did we get? She just pulls up. Angel. She's like a freaking angel. We were meant to hike that bridge. Okay. Let's do this. That's exactly where we go. Full circle moment. Had we known we were there. Okay. Let's head down there. Literally, that's how close we were. Gosh. I don't know how many meters we are. 13 feet, we're good. <gasps> it's our first covered bridge of this of the trip. Of the trip. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alright. Attempt number 20. Four? I think so. It's four. Well, let's do, do this. I'm assuming that it's this side. Because that says disc golf. Yeah. I see there's it says Welcome Center. Let's go see. Hello. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. How can I help you? Would like to go on the bridge? Yes. Yes. <laughs> how did you know? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> this is your ticket for all the day. Okay. Stay with, uh, not stay with, uh, keep with you. Okay. And this is the cookie I pay your account. Yes, and if you would like to go on the bridge from here, uh -huh. we are there. Okay. The bridge was there. Little did we know that this bridge we had driven by and wanted to see so bad was actually the longest suspended footbridge in North America. And to get here, we would hike the La Gorge Trail, if I'm saying that right, which is a little over two miles. And not only were we gonna get to see a suspended footbridge, but an observation tower, a hydroelectric power station, a cave, and so much more. Well, we got in. We did it. I wouldn't say success yet. We still need to make it to the top because it's quite a bit longer of a hike. <laughs> than we, we were just, anticipating. Uh, yeah. We were thinking a little quick drop, drop yeah. across the bridge. Right, it was Boy, literally like- were we wrong. Park here, walk up to the top of the hill and cross, but mm -mm. it's a little more involved than that now. Yeah, but. It's going to be worth it, Bob. I just know it. It is beautiful. That's for oh, sure. So it's the best okay. day. It's 50 degrees out, guys. Follow the, Follow the, the gorge trail. 18%. Okay. okay, here we go. All right. We got this. Well, when we're out of breath, we'll catch up with you here in a second. Okay. Is this just like a, a stream? Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's freezing. Like, like incredibly cold. Okay. Okay. Like, does it get any better than this? All right, Hiller, you need to step it up. We've got like almost two full kilometers to hike. Well, I can't we get, get my glove back on. Shouldn't have taken it off. You're just horsing around, playing in the water. I think we're on the right path. Feels right. So this is where we would have started, right here. Correct. There's like frost on this bridge. That just tells you how cold it actually is. Oh man, look at these stairs. Stop. I thought I was in better shape than this, Bob. Hopefully you can't hear my heavy breathing. I'm trying to keep it under control. <laughs> okay. So apparently I was reading a little bit about what all this is. It's something about like the forest comes alive at night. And so they light it up so you can hike it at night and everything's lit up. They put lights everywhere. So 
Oh Come on, Hillary, we're almost there. You can do it. Whew. Okay, so we made it to the top. Literally one hour ago, we were right here on the other side of this gate with no way to get in. So now we're ready to cross the suspension bridge. Even with my limited knowledge of construction, I have to admit. Is this well done? I'm, I'm a little nervous. Oh. Why? It's, it's safe. It's Are you safe. Sure? But it does make me nervous. It does move when we walk on it. Well, it's because it's a suspension bridge. Okay. That's okay. But it's a little unsettling. Okay, let's get across. Okay, let's walk to the other side. Actually, but first, I gotta show you some of these views. I mean, don't put it up. just don't drop our camera. Look at this gorge. Okay, no need to be nervous. No need to be nervous. It is moving, but it's gorgeous. It's so worth it, guys. Okay, if you're ever in Canada, wherever this is, I'll put it right there. You have to come do this hike. It's literally one of the best hikes I've ever done. And we just did a hike on last week's video. That was the best one I ever did too. They're both amazing, do them both. Oh, look at that, Bob. Oh no, we just climbed up a huge hill because we were like, yeah, let's go to that tower she was talking about where you get to see the city. Let me show you the tower. This is not good. Oh, they built this in 1986. It's 96 feet tall or 129 meters. It was built in 1986 using trunks of red pine 82 feet long, imported from British Columbia. Hey, they said it's only 120 steps. All right, let's get a step in. Let's do it. Oh, 120 steps later, here oh. we are at the top. Oh. We did that in a hurry, kind of out of breath. But boy, is it beautiful. Oh my oh. word, it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Wow, wow. So somewhere right here is called the pothole. It says it's 10,000 years old, and it says it was formed by very hard stone caught up in a whirlpool. So I don't know if it's right here. No, it's right there. Oh, it's right here? Oh, yeah, wow. Oh, more my pothole. That's very cool. Okay, so now we're heading down under the bridge that we were on. But first, we need to survive this trail. What? It's, it's pretty steep. Is it? I mean, camera flattens everything out. But That's true. That was a pretty steep Climb. incline we just came down a second ago. That is true. Oh, and there's some stairs. Oh, that's right. She said stairs. So I guess this river empties eventually into the Mississippi. I'm assuming that it would have to go through like maybe the Ohio River and kind of work its way down that way. I don't know, but that's kind of interesting that you could literally maybe take like a kayak or something and kayak from basically central Canada all the way down to the Mississippi, to the Gulf of Mexico? No. Should we do that? So clearly the water must top the dam in the springtime when it's like spring melt because you can see the erosion right there across the top of the dam. And the force has actually bent, I think that's rebar, has bent it away from us in the flow of the water. But it's pretty crazy to see all that erosion. That's 
so cool. This is the power station, right? Yep. Daylight is calling. Welcome up the dawn. So I know this place offers camping as well. And it looks like they've got a couple of spots right here. I don't know if these are for tents or RVs. I mean, there's no hookups or anything. I think it's just tents because the little teeny sign says a tent. That's true, but I just don't know if that's a sign for camping, you know? I just... Uh-oh, here comes the oh, kids. We have to run. Oh, but yeah. you're nice and close to the river, so that's really cool. Even if it's to... just tents? Oh, gorgeous. yeah. Tents, you could do a little fly fishing down there. Oh, my god. Listen to the river all night long. Amazing. You're sold. I'll book two. We're coming back. <laughs> we have to come back. We need to come back in the summertime when we can actually book a campsite and be here for like a week. Yes, but we got to hurry because these kids are right on our tail and we don't want to obviously put them on video at all. So we're hurt. And some of us are hungry, hangry. Are you hangry? Uh, getting there. The donuts certainly didn't help the blood sugar. I'm just saying. Oh, it gave me energy, man. Nope. It makes me crash. They've got some cabins right here and they have little tents next to those signs as well. So I think tent must just be for camping, not necessarily like a tent site. Do you think we can bring our RV down here? I believe on the other side of the welcome center, there were RV spots over there. So I don't know. We'll have to take a look and see what we can find on the other side. I hear the kids running. They're going to run you over. They are. They're ready. They pro it's probably lunchtime for them. It's lunchtime for us. We're back. We did it. We did the loop. We made it. We made it. Attempt number four was a... Absolute success. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> We're like, what are we doing with our hands? <laughs> it's fine. Oh, it's fine. Okay. So now we have another cool spot picked out. Hopefully it's cool. And we're going to go have lunch there and who knows what else. Should we go through and out or sure. around and out? Uh, Here, we'll take this little stone path. Okay. Okay. We did it. And we're literally right back at the dump. The dump station. We are back. Two hours later. We did it. We hiked. That was amazing. That was worth it. That was pretty awesome. I'm glad we did that. I literally saw a bridge and two hours later, we had an epic adventure. It definitely was. I mean, honestly, that's something worth coming back for to stay at that camp mm -hmm. ground that they have right there. Mm -hmm. going to downtown Magog. Magog? Magog. Magog. The guy at the border said we were saying it right, so we'll just go with that. I'm gonna go pay to park. You wanna shut all this down and meet me in there or meet, I'll be back? Yeah. Bye guys, we'll see ya downtown somewhere. Parking, check. So we think we found a microbrewery. It's in French, but we're pretty sure. Pop's happy. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Okay, guys, I ordered poutine, which is like fries with cheese curds and gravy as our appetizer. I've seen it online. I've never had it, but it looks so good. I am so excited to try it. So, cheers. Ah. It's good. Oh, it's got a little flavor to it. That's not bad. What'd you order? The ale. Oh. I cannot say it. Okay. 
just lay off. Yeah. Here. <laughs> Point to it. This is what I ordered. Love things apart. Sure. <laughs> Mm. Looks disgusting. It's so good. Is it? Do oh. you think I'll like it? You better. It's so amazing. Mm. So this is a cheese curd. That is and a cheese a fry curd. And gravy. Oh, you see that steam? These are hot. That was amazing. Wow. Okay. You go, Canada. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I ordered the smoked hot dog. Is that a hot dog? I, I, I don't know. You're gonna find out. I'm gonna find out. They give you mayo for fries here? No, thank you. But I think that's cool. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give this a try. Mmm. Mm. That is really good. What's it taste like? It tastes like a hot dog with cheese and onions and bacon on it. Okay. It's really good though. And it's purple. And I mm. ordered just a regular old... American, American cheeseburger. cheeseburger. American cheeseburger. Okay. Magog? 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 Magog. Shopping observations. I think we're in downtown. It's so cute. We're definitely gonna have to get like an ice cream or something, but as far as like gift shops and stuff, like I think it's just real shopping. I think it is where they come to actually like shop. It's not like touristy that I can True. tell. Yeah, I agree. It's definitely not touristy. Like there's not a bunch of shops with a bunch of junk that you don't really need. It's hey. actually like real stores with like shoes and clothes and like nice yeah. stuff. Things that you would actually need. Yeah, that's what we've observed yeah. so far. We're still walking it. So we'll let you know if we find anything like that because I am looking for a gift shop. I want something from Canada. Bye. Well, we can always go to Walmart. All right, somebody help me. Is a blinking green in Canada the equivalent of like a left arrow or a, a right arrow? Or is it an equivalent of go? Do you see solid Well, see, green? like I see a solid arrow right there. Yeah. And Which then, to me would have been like, you can turn, but you have to stop. Oh, now there's a solid green. So what's the difference between solid green and blinking green? I'm super confused. Now this is a first. Now we have a green arrow forward and a green arrow right. But I still don't understand the double red. No, the double the double red or the blinking green. Well, why why the double red? Why not have, well, it seems like whoever is selling red lights is making a lot of money because you only need one. <laughs> well, it must be the sun. Right here? Yeah. Nope, not right here. Right there, it says. Hillary, I'm going, we're going through the border crossing. No, that's the store. It's right there. Yes. So I turn right? Yes. So, yes. I think in this little lane right here, you see it? Okay. Right here? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Take a slight right turn, then 
Yes. Destination is See? Was I right? But right here. It's right there. It's uh, my phone did the wrong thing. But now we're good. Okay. <sighs> we are at the border after a super fun day exploring Canada. We're back at the border and we're going to go look at what you can get in their duty free store that yep. we almost couldn't find and Bob almost lost his mind. I legitimately almost lost my mind. <laughs> that was annoying. Yeah. But we're here. Uh -huh. We can go in, get some duty free. Whatever. Junk. For our children. And then uh, proceed back into the United States. Hopefully yeah. they let us back in. We'll see. We're at the border. I've never seen a store like this at a border. I mean, I guess at airports. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Right. Look at this receipt. <laughs> crazy. Damage was done. Damage was done. So crazy. <laughs> it actually wasn't that bad, though. And we got gifts for our family. That's true. I mean, we went to Canada. This is what you do. All right. And Bob doesn't know it, but I got him a hat. <laughs> like, in a cool one. All right. We'll show you. Okay. All right. So, Bob. Here's what I got you. This is my new hat. This is your new hat. Here. All right. Here, here you go. <laughs> I love it. I know. I wouldn't wear it quite like that. Okay. Let's let's go over the border into the United States with. <laughs> let's go over there like this. <laughs> All like, right. What you buy from Canada? <laughs> He's like, they're going to be like, we just got back from Canada, literally for the, we're there for a day. But guess what? We want to stay there. We loved it so much. So much we're moving. Oh and look at this cool thing I got. I don't, the lighting is so bad right here. We might have to like move the van to get it more in the shade, but like. Have you ever seen? I don't even know if Bob saw me buy this. Bob, doesn't this make you want to have a Tic Tac? No. <laughs> Look how big I, that is. I couldn't it pass be it interesting. up. It'll interesting. I guess they're supposed to be made differently. And better. And, and better for you in Canada. So in that regard, yes, I'd be interested to try it. But outside of that. Guess what? Everybody we know is getting a box of Tic Tacs. <laughs> Here's your gift, guys. All right, you got the passports? Oh, oh, where's our passports? Where are our passports? I seriously don't know. That was, uh, that was my job. That was your job. I had one job. No. Oh, I hit him. Uh, hold on. I got it. I got it. <laughs> got our passports. When they asked me, did you get anything? I'm going to literally say, no, just this hat. <laughs> We're going to, no, Bob, this, no, no. <laughs> I was there for a day and, and just got a hat. <laughs> so dumb. I'm sorry, but we're ridiculous. Are we really going to wear these? Uh, why not? I mean, what? It, they're... <laughs> you can't, you can't. <laughs> I'll be embarrassed. We're doing it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Wish us luck with the border agents. <laughs> They're either going to be like, excuse me, you need to pull over here. We got to talk. Okay. Did you see all the signs? No weed? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We're going to check. <laughs> my stomach is hurting so bad. Are we really going to? Should I put my Canada's new sweatshirt on? I mean. <laughs> You got your main. <laughs> we went to Maine. We went to Canada. We'd be like, guess where we went? And they're gonna be like, we know. <laughs> My stomach hurts so bad. <laughs> well, at least no one's in line. 
<laughs> RV. Oh, wait, RV. Oh, RV. RV and cars. Me, like... <laughs> Same line. They did have a I Love Canada t shirt that I passed up. Do we need to go back? No. All right. Here we go. It says declare. What do we have to declare? Fruits and vegetables. Which we did nothing. Everything we have is from the United States. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Where do you live? Arizona. What brings you up here? Uh, we we're actually in Maine, so we just swung up here for the, the day and had yeah. lunch, and nice. now we're headed back. Yep. And did you buy anything in Canada coming back into the U.S.? Maybe? We did at the duty-free duty free free store. Some cool hats. Yeah, nice. <laughs> All set. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. You. Yeah. you too. I guess I don't have it drive. We're not for sure. Our camera just died, so we don't know how much just got shown. But this is where we're going to leave you. We just got through the border crossing yep. Yep. with these hats on and we are back in the united states we're back in the, in the united states we're in vermont and next week guys oh. we are doing something that we are both so excited to do yes it might be the best thing up until this point that we've done we're not for sure yet, though. We've done it some could be amazing. Cool things. It could be amazing. It could be amazing. I, I expect it, it to be amazing. I expect it to be phenomenal. So stay tuned. Don't miss next week's video. It's gonna be good. Big thing. <laughs> and uh, next week, you're gonna see Bob fix the water leak. Because we're actually headed to Home Depot right now. Yes. We need to stop by the hardware store. Well, First, we need to do some exploratory work. Yeah. Then we will stop by the hardware store and get what we need to fix this. Yeah. So, fingers crossed there. Say a prayer that we get the water leak fixed because that's not fun. No. But that's all we have. Thanks for coming to Canada with us. I hope you enjoyed today's video. This was a surprise video to us. <laughs> it certainly was. This was not on the itinerary at the beginning of this trip, but that's kind of how we roll. Absolutely. But, okay. Until next time. All right. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.